Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to completely remove your graphics card drivers from your system using Display Driver Uninstaller, which is also known as DDU. Now, the reason why you'd want to do this is if your system is having problems related to the drivers or if you swap graphics cards. So say you have like a 20 series GPU and you switch to a 30 series or 40 series, what you want to do is remove all traces of the old driver and install the new driver. So in this video, that's what I'm going to show you how to do. And it's not really that hard. You just need to download the driver and DDU and then um, boot into safe mode. And that's about it. So let's get started. So what you want to do first is just go download uh, DDU, I'll have the link in the description, and then also download whatever driver you want to install. And so I'm going to install 528.49, so I have it downloaded already on my computer. And once you have both of those things ready, um, all we got to do now is boot into safe mode. So for Windows 10 and Windows 11, you just want to go to your Windows uh, menu and then click on the power button. Then you want to hold down the shift key on your keyboard and then hit restart. And once it uh, restarts, you want to scroll down to troubleshoot. Then go to startup settings and then hit restart. And then now it's either going to restart into the Windows start settings menu which is like blue and then it could also restart into your motherboards uh, restart settings which looks like this and if you get this one just hit safe mode and then if you get the Windows one just hit whatever number on the keyboard is next to safe mode I don't remember which number it is but whatever it is just click it on your keyboard and it should uh, restart And then once you restart, you will get into something that looks like this. It should say so safe mode on all four corners. Now from there, all you got to do is open up DDU. I like to run it as administrator, so just right click and hit run as administrator. You'll get this message, just hit OK. The options should pop up. And the only thing we need to change in here is, of course, if you want to remove Physics X, just check that. Um, I leave it unchecked, but at the bottom where advanced options are, you want to hit, you want to check prevent when uh, downloads of drivers from Windows Update. And basically that, all that's going to do is whenever we uninstall the driver and then you restart your computer, or I mean, it's going to restart the computer by itself, but whatever, whenever it boots back into regular Windows, the Windows installer isn't going to install like the default graphics card package that it has it's going to get blocked so just choose your G choose gpu and your device mine's in the video and then hit clean and restart and then all you got to do is just wait until it finishes doing what it's doing and then it'll restart your computer for you All right, so once your computer is restarted back into normal Windows, what you want to do is just install the graphics driver that you downloaded. So in this um, example, I'm using 528.49, but it doesn't have to be the same driver. You know what I mean? You can download whichever driver you want. 
Normally, I'll install the newest driver unless I know that there's some problems uh, with it. But one thing to keep in mind is that whenever you completely wipe your drivers like this, anything that you had set within the NVIDIA control panel or within like the GeForce Experience app, all those settings are going to be completely erased. So if you know what you're doing and you change them, you should be fine because you can just go back and set them to whatever you had. Now, if you have never opened the NVIDIA control panel or if you never changed any of the settings, then you probably don't have to worry about it because they would be set at the default and when you install the driver again it's going to be set at the default but if you've had somebody like mess with your settings for you what you would want to do before um, running DDU is like go into the NVIDIA control panel and copy those settings down somehow like maybe take a screenshot and save the screenshots in a folder but afterwards whenever the driver is done installing what you're going to want to do is go back inside the control panel and set whatever you had set but other than that it's just uninstall and reinstall and so we just gotta wait for the driver to finish installing and then after that there's only one more thing you need to do and you'll be done so let's just let it install and then pick it back up All right, once the installation finishes, you can just close it out and you're gonna wanna open DDU one more time, this time from within normal windows. And once it's open, you just hit okay, but you wanna check, or you wanna hit this button that says set Windows device installation settings to default. Since we checked that box in safe mode that blocked it, we just wanna uh, set it to default so that you don't run into any issues trying to install new things that you plug into your computer. But that's how you completely remove the drivers from your system so hopefully my video helped you out feel free to like comment and subscribe and leave any comments you have below and i'll catch you guys in the next one